Yes, absolutely, absolutely, my friends. What's going on, everybody? This is Luke Pico with IroncladConfidence.com. Coming to you guys today, baby. Another amazing freaking video, dude. <laughs> yeah, buddy, baby. So check it out, my friends. If you guys are new here to the podcast or the videos, I do a podcast too, dude. It's on SoundCloud. <laughs> Anyways, if you guys are new here to the YouTube channel, you guys on this channel, I freestyle, baby. I straight up jaw drop truth that will blow your mind if you're open to receive it, right? You could throw people a ball all day long. You could play catch with people all day long, but if they don't catch the ball, what's the point, right? So guess what? On this channel, we talk about the psychology of confidence. We talk about the psychology of transformation. I share with you some powerful insights when it comes to What's going on behind the scenes of your psychology in the invisible world, dude? You want to learn how reality works? You want to tap into true confidence? You understand something? That's what we talk on this channel, dude. And that's what I'm going to share with you today. If you dig my style, if you dig my vibe, if you dig my energy, then maybe you can vibe with it, right? Maybe you can understand. Maybe the creator will, will give you the ability to receive, right? Not everyone can receive. You understand that? Not everyone can receive wisdom from above, dude. <laughs> Not everyone can receive it. Some people got too many filters, you guys. They got too many egoic filters that they've been programmed with their whole life. And what I do is I'm straightforward, baby. I cut through all the BS and I jaw drop truth. I jaw drop insights, right? That means you have internal sight inside of yourself. Oh, Luke, you're stating the obvious. You're always talking about this stuff. In fact, you're a comedian, dude. Because, you know, you got charisma, baby. Right? <laughs> people always got to dumb your version down if they see you shine, baby. That's the way it goes. That's what people do. It makes them feel good about themselves. Because then they got something to hold on to. Right? But see, here's the, pr here, here's the problem with that. That egoic side of you is not confident. You think it's confidence. That ain't confidence. That's ego. That's ego. And guess what? Your ego is not your flipping amigo, dude. <laughs> yeah, buddy. I have a good time, baby. That's why I laugh at myself. I don't care if people say, oh, he's pretending. He's an actor. Guess what? All the world's a stage. Everyone's acting. Everyone's pretending. They're pretending what they're going to do with their life. They're demonstrating what they want to believe. What are you going to do? See, the psychology of confidence. You even understand what that means? You understand what psychology means? Biology, terminology, right? All these ologies. It's all part of what's going on in the crystal kingdom of your fucking psychology and what you want to do with it. What do you believe is true about you and what you can do, dude? <laughs> yeah, buddy. It's the way it goes, baby. A lot of people, they don't know that. And so guess what? Psychology is... The receiving of information and communication. If you can receive that insight, if you can receive that knowledge, if you can receive that wisdom, if you can receive that psychology, then you can grow. You can learn, right? You can transform. Why is it called building a winning energy, a winning attitude, a winning? Why is it called winning? What's the point of winning, right? The point of winning is so that you can prove back to yourself that you can achieve what you set your mind to. See, a winner isn't just somebody who gets a prize or gets money or gets anything. Winning is the ability to prove back to yourself that you can achieve whatever outcome that is. Oh, oh, oh. This is the way it goes. And so guess what? You can only achieve that if you can receive the information, right? Because that's what psychology is. It's information and it's communication. And guess what, dude? You're communicating information to yourself all day, every day. Rewind, say it again. You should blow your mind, dude, the stuff that I share with you. The information that you work with every single day, that you've been accumulating, that you've been mopping up from the world around you every single day, it's information. That information can elevate you. It can improve you. It can change you. It can give you the ability to create a completely different reality. The only reason you go to school, the only reason you go to college is so that you can get locked into that category of information, psychology, 
And then once you enter that information and that psychology and you put your soul in that environment and you get dipped in that environment of information over and over again, guess what, baby? Guess what? You ain't going to believe it. That information, it's going to get sticky on you, dude. It's going to become part of your program. It's going to become part of the lexicon called you, right? <laughs> this is what it's going to do. It's going to become part of you. And then you can use that information to skillfully develop those skill sets, right? You become a brain surgeon. You become a heart surgeon. You become a doctor. You become a lawyer. You become a construction worker. I don't care what it is you do. You're taking your identity, your level of psychology, your who you are, and you're putting it in the confidence of that information. Rewind, say it again. You freaking rock your world, dude. <laughs> you're putting who you are every day in the information of that confidence. See, the only reason you're good at what you do, whatever that may be, is because you have internalized the psychology of that confidence. See, a car mechanic, he's confident in his ability, dude. He's, he's performed whatever mechanical procedure he needs to do over and over again to prove back to himself that I got the confidence to fix that. I got the confidence to do that. See, but you don't get to have what you don't receive. That was freaking huge there, dude. <laughs> you don't get to have what you don't receive. Meaning I can share with you all day how to freaking build confidence, how to build motivation, how to build the winning attitude, how to build the winning energy into who you are. But if you don't receive it, what's the point? What's the point, right? Because you ain't going to be, you're not going to have that confidence. This is why I don't focus on mainstream social on media. I don't say social media on media in general. I don't focus on agendas and all this other stuff that isn't going to do nothing but distract you. All that stuff's going to do is shift your direction, shift your focus into that direction. And what is that going to do for you if you haven't been working on you? You know what it's going to do for you if you haven't been working on you? It's going to give you the anxiety, the stress, the fear, the worry of that information. And unless you got you figured out, guess what? It don't matter, dude. <laughs> Why do you think I freaking work on myself? Why do you think I talk about internalization, laws of attraction, right? Confidence building, courage, baby, boldness, dude, charisma, dude, right? Enthusiasm, buddy. What you want? Some people live life, they're living life all angry and all sad and all depressed and walking around all, you know, and believe me, dude, it gets to you. See, I live in the real world, dude. I live in the real world. A lot of people online, they live in the pretend world. A lot of people online, they ain't out in the fucking hustle. They ain't out in the hustle. They ain't trying. See, everyone's living in their own reality. Everyone is. I am, you are, they are. Everyone is. And so when I come to you walking in freaking, you know, paradise, dude, sharing knowledge, guess what? I still got to work. I still got to pay bills. I still got responsibilities. I'm still hustling and grinding. I'm putting myself out there, right? I'm being responsible. But at the same time, I take care of this. And I've been doing it forever. I've been doing it since I was freak for the last 15 years, hardcore. Meaning with intention, with direction, with absolute certainty and conviction, dude. <laughs> and so what you want to do, who you want to be, what kind of mindset do you want to build? You understand that you're, you're literally getting mopped around in information which carries energy. I talk about it all the time. My stuff's a little rusty. Why? Because... I'm out here, you know, after my house burning down and losing everything, you know, still working, still hustling, but still taking the time to do what? Reality check. Guess what? I got my thinking figured out. And so guess what? Every day is a battle because you got to battle ideas. You got to battle whatever it is you're dealing with. You got to battle with nonsense. You got to battle with people trying to challenge you, which they have to because they have to prove it back to themselves. But guess what? They're going to lose. <laughs> if you got you figured out that's why I talk about this stuff that's why I talk about these deep concepts because you only get confidence you only develop that level that framework of psychology if you have been implementing and teaching yourself every day that's that's what you want psychology is the inform is the receiving of information and the ability to communicate what you're communicating to yourself to prove back to yourself that you are that person. 
Not everyone has confidence. Don't get fooled. A lot of people think they have confidence. They ain't even bringing it on this level, dude. People don't even bring confidence out into the open as in words and then, oh, oh, that's what you're talking about? They just believe inside. Well, I'm just this. You understand something? You've been programmed your whole life, dude. You have been professionally programmed by information and data. That's why you believe the way you believe. I believe the way I believe. But the difference is, is I didn't see most people stop growing in life. <laughs> most people stop growing. They don't even bring it on that level. They finish school, they learn some skill sets, they get a job, that's it, I'm done. Now I'm just gonna have fun, party on the weekend, do what I can to enjoy myself while I still work. And the whole time they ask for more, they don't get more because they, as soon as they get more, okay, now I can back away. Completely contradict themselves. People do this all the time. And so you gotta decide who you're gonna be. You are with you everywhere you go. You have to decide what kind of mindset do you wanna build. It's easy to fall into a poor me victimization. I can't do it. Believe me. That's why I step on the stage every day, pick up the microphone in my mouth and pay attention. I might not always record it on here, but I'm paying attention to it here and what I'm telling myself. And guess what? Sometimes when I really feel like coming out, guess what, dude? I pick up the freaking tools. I pick up the recorder and I share what's already being recorded inside. You understand you're a freaking, you're recording every day. You're a recorder. You're fu you are a, a, a recorder. You understand since the day you were born, a freaking re a, a recorder has been flipped on and you have been subconsciously recording. Your body has been recording your whole reality. No, it isn't Luke. It's not. Then you have no memory about anything. Because the only way you have a memory is because your subconscious body, your subconscious mind recorded that information. Well, why is that important? Because whatever information you hang around is the information that gets recorded into the, into the, uh, uh, you know, you. Why you think people go through life living all kinds of hard lives? They get programmed by a bunch of nonsense, a bunch of random bad information. Guess what? They're going to wind up subconsciously, not intentionally picking up that record that record right that record label dude <laughs> that record of information next thing you know they're copycatting what mom did they're copycatting what their friends did they're copycatting what their dad did they're copycatting every other person around them alcoholic becomes an alcoholic because they hang around people who drink a lot of alcohol and they're alcoholics and guess what they pick up that pattern same is true for everything us humans, we get addicted to all kinds of stuff, but we don't even bring it on that level. We're too busy with the with reality, right? With the hustle and bustle, baby. We're t we're we're you know consumed with debt and bills and and doing this and doing that and staying ahead of the game. This is how it goes. But if you don't buy out the opportunity, if you don't buy out the time, meaning if you don't take the time to prove back to yourself who you are, then you're going to get lost in translation dude <laughs> you're gonna get lost in translation you ain't gonna know who you are you're not gonna build that winning energy and guess what it's hard because some days the world's coming at you you have all this information you gotta process because you're a processor of that information in fact you live in the process of the information that's processing you <laughs> and guess what that's what you get that's what you create and so guess what? You have to buy out the time to shift your focus, to create amazingness in your psychology. And guess what? You could tell yourself all day, oh, that was good information. That was amazing. But here's the key, dude. If you don't believe it, it doesn't matter. I could share with you wisdom that would transform your life. Wisdom. There's no shortage of millionaires, dude. There's no sh shortage of millionaires. There's millionaires everywhere. The only difference between them and you and them is that they have information that you don't understand or you've never been a part of or you've never hung around your whole life. So in turn, you form an egoic identity and say, no, nah, those people are bad. No, nah, those people are greedy. No, nah, those people are because they're, they have that. They're this, this and that. Bunch of bullshit. That's all it is. It's just information. That's like blaming a, a, you know, a cop or a firefighter or an electrician because... You know, this, it, it don't make sense. 
Just like you are what you are, they are what they are. And so guess what? What are you going to do, dude? You want to learn the psychology of confidence? You want to learn the psychology of building that winning energy? That winning attitude? You want to have the glorious freedom of the children of God? You want freeness of speech? This ain't a religious channel, dude. I don't go in that direction. I stay focused on the truth. And I stay focused on the psychology. And I stay focused on what's important, right? Pay constant attention to yourself and your teachings and you will save both yourself and those who listen to you see i ain't responsible for the whole freaking world i ain't responsible for other people i'm only responsible for me that's it if i navigate me successfully hopefully that success rubs off on the world around me and that's the way it was created to be and so i ask you what you want to do dude what you want to do baby there ain't no quitting just because I fucking get knocked down don't mean I ain't going to get back up. Just because you have a setback don't mean you're not going to get back up. Just because, you know, and a lot of people, they just, they, as soon as they, they, they hit a roadblock, they hit a plateau. Uh, this is too hard. They quit. They stop. They, you know, who cares? It don't matter. It's not that important. Believe me, dude. It's easier said than done. But see, the only thing that matters is you're proving it back to yourself. You're proving back to your, I expect more of me than anyone else. I always expect more from me than I do of other people. Because when you expect more from you than other people, then guess what? At least you will prove back to yourself what you're going to expect. But if you expect something from other people, guess what? Other people, circumstances, events, it's going to let you down. Next thing you know, you've been putting your faith and your trust in the wrong people, in the wrong information. So for me... If I deposit confidence in myself, if I deposit trust in myself, if I deposit truth in myself, regardless of how bad it feels to experience hearing the truth, it's good for you, dude. It's good for you, even if you don't want to hear it. Why? Because if you, you know, you got a good soul, then maybe your soul can latch on to it and say, you know what, let me use this, let me work with it. I ain't going to get it right. I just got to get it going, dude. <laughs> Dang, baby. And that, my friends, is the psychology of confidence and building that winning energy. There's, there is energy attached to information, and there's information floating around everywhere. You decide what you want. You decide. That's why I'm fearless, baby. That's why I'm fearless. You cannot intimidate me, dude. Believe me. I got a fucking juggernaut mindset. You see? And that's the point. That's the point. I got it here which means I hold it here <laughs> and it comes out of here, baby. This is where it goes. Why think I teach this stuff? In fact, sometimes I've even said it before, my information so, so powerful, I just take it off. I just take it off. So powerful, no one wants it. Hey, all to me, the creator said, here's the treasures of heaven, you get them. You get them, you get them, you get them, you use it. Why? Cause it's magnificent. It's spectacular. You want to learn how to have freeness of speech? You want to know who you are? You want to walk with complete confidence, faith, and trust in the truth? Because that's what confidence is. Rewind, say it again. <laughs> confidence is complete faith, complete trust in the truth. Because that's the only thing that's indestructible. That's the only thing that's consistent is the truth. Everything else is a superficial passing gesture it's just it's just here now and gone later you can't trust in it it's always changing and so for me i live in the truth to the best of my imperfect ability just like you and me and everyone else <laughs> dang dude and that my friends is what i've learned about the psychology i'm a true thoroughbred they don't build mindsets like me no more baby you better believe that I'm a 100% authentic, 100% original, dude. Psychology from the heavens above, baby. <laughs> so you want to learn from a real psychologist? You want to learn how to build true endurance? You want to learn how to build true strength? See, I don't need to have all kinds of success and all that. Sure, that's what I do. I, I'm moving towards, but I don't need it because it's right here. That's why you, you take anyone. I don't care how big you think they are. You bring them up against this mindset that I got. Game over, you lost. Said and done, dude. <laughs> Dang, baby. Why? Because I carry it here. 
And that's all that matters to me is right here. Where it comes from, where it stems from. This lets me walk in the power, walk in the energy, walk in the confidence, walk in the courage, walk in the charisma, dude. <laughs> Dang, baby. And so guess what? What do you want to do? These are your questions you got to ask yourself. What do you want to do? What do you want to create? Who do you believe you are? What kind of success do you want to have? You want to have true success? Come see me, dude. In fact, you want true success? Consider subscribing, dude. You like the video, baby? Boom, dude, smash that thumbs up button and hit the little bell notification if you want to receive updates when I rock these kind of videos, dude. But I do thank you guys, and I do look forward to talking to you champions again next time, baby. Peace. <laughs> yeah, buddy. When you get honest with yourself, when you give yourself correction, that was huge. Rewind, say it again. <laughs> when you give yourself correction and you receive that correction, that, my friends, is when you're going to start to build and construct a psychology, an indestructible psychology of confidence right here. Complete faith, complete trust in the truth, dude. And that is when you will learn how to build that winning energy, baby. <laughs> Done, dude.